Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Happy haulers. How are you? Dun, 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 dun. That's all I think I need to say. But I know I need to say just a little bit more. I ran out, ran around the circle, which I call a circle. Well, I call it the square. My friend, she called it circle. But anyway, my neighborhood, I feel like it's like you go around, it's a square shape, you drive, and you hit all the good stores and come on back home. Restaurants and everything. So, it's really convenient. Um, and everything is about 10 minutes away. Like, Tobby Lobby. That's what we're talking about. This is a haul. So... If you've been to your store, cause, and they haven't put the quilling papers and stuff on sale, clearance and amount, then um, here, here it is. They are clearance and amount from the two ninety nine to seventy four cents. Um, my store that's close to me is the last store. Now, um, the last store in my area to put this anything on sale. And what I'll say about that is I was kind of trying to explain in the video I just posted uh, like yesterday before. I was trying to explain that if you look at your Hobby Lobbies and the way people shop, well, if you look at your Hobby Lobbies, the sale prices usually seem to go like say whichever Hobby Lobby was the first one in your area like in my area Hoover even though I'm in Birmingham Hoover is the store that was here first and by itself for a long long time so they tend to get their emails to do their reductions first but sometimes I go there and I maybe I'm just in time and let you see the different color schemes this is um um, called pink shades. Oops, sorry. Sorry, I'm just hitting, hitting, hitting. And this one was called Holiday Colors. It has a green, red, a darker red, like maroon, a white, a gray, or silver. They probably want it to be silver. Your green, your Hunter Green and Kelly. And then you got a beige and then you got a taupe. Um, and then here's another one. It's called Warm Colors. I don't know if it may have been for fall. But it does have fall colors. Like it has a maroon again. A red. A pink. Um, like a burnt orange. And a maize. I'm naming these these colors. <laughs> but you can probably go on quiltcreations.com. And they'll give you the exact um, names of the colors. But what I was saying. In case you're a person who wants to hear what I was saying about the stores. So if you have more than one loca location, like in my in location within 30 mile perimeter from my house, Hoover is 30 minutes away, but it was the store that had the Hobby Lobby first and only for like a lot of years. And so their markdowns will come down first. So if, you, if I really want to know, I need to go to Hoover. Then I don't know which came first after that. If it was Lakeshore, Gardendale, or 280. Um, those, um, Lakeshore is maybe probably 20 minutes from my house. Gardendale is about 20 minutes from my house. And the t um, 280 store probably is about 30. It just depends on traffic too. Um, but theirs will come down later. Then, so that was 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm missing a store. Hoover. Yeah, that's 3, 4. And then I'm talking about my store and Trustful. So I said six, but um, what am I missing? Hoover, Lakeshore, Gardendale, 280. That's another one, someone. But anyway, my store is the last store that came. So I just happened to say, look, I've been in the house all day. My husband was at home last night. So, I was like, this is my chance to go, and if I want to shop all night long until the store is closed, I can, because my children won't be here in fear that something happened to me or something's going to happen. And it's not that, that they necessarily were, but one time I had a doctor's appointment that was late, and I left them here. 
And then they heard sirens in the neighborhood, and it kind of threw them off, like, you know, what do we do, what's going on, and calling me, and kind of, you know, teary sounding, but not crying, so they said. So, you know, if I know I'm going to stay out too late, I kind of try to tend to get back home. But since my husband was here, I went out, and to my surprise, the... <laughs> The quilling kit, that snowflake quilling kit that you'll see is, is the thumbnail on the video that I went all the way over to the 280 store to get. And I mean, I'm I'm not complaining because I needed to go see my niece anyway. And I'm going to go see her again tomorrow before she leaves. Um, she's closing on the house this, next, this Tuesday the 14th and then she's moving to Baltimore, Maryland on the 16th and signing for her next house and she'll start her job in April but she's going to Dubai before she goes so she has a lot going on beautiful life and we all do we all have beautiful life and so <clears throat> but I'm just saying I was telling you about how I went over to see her and get ice cream yogurt for the girls and you know hanging out just to get that and then voila at my store last night they had two of them and they were on sale. Now, let me let you know, they are not discounting the books. I didn't see them discount the books, the husking tool, I think it's called, because they already discontinued the comb. So some of the other stuff, those other kits and stuff, not yet. But they still had a lot of stuff at my store because, like I said, it's the last one. Now, this is something else I got. I had it right on top. And, you know, they have these books at the front, and they're discounted. And I would have gotten a purple one for, you know, prayers for women. But I was like, I think I got that. So I don't want to get it twice because I know I do have some of them. But I need to check. And I have a, be a bunch of, be still and know because I do like that scripture. Um, but this one in particular I got, 365 Promises from God's Word and Color. Be blessed as you color in the inspirational designs reflecting on God's words of promise. And it was a... Uh, Original five nine ninety nine. Can you see? And it's um four ninety nine. And I like getting coloring books, and I like this and take tangle stuff. And I used to draw like this without knowing. You know, I always say, oh, I I wish I could run down and get a picture I did back in college. That was a zentangle. Before I knew what zentangle, a zentangle, how you know some people have it with a Z. I've seen it with a Z with most Japanese, and then I've seen some zentangles with the S. But um well there is a copyright but I'm gonna flip through quick I'll show you just quick but you kinda know what it is. But it's saying that it's God's word and color and it will help you to unwind and take a therapeutic break after a busy day. Or doing a break at work or lunch. You know it depends on how you have it set up. Some people at my work, some of us hang out and some of us don't. I kind of hang out because I got a, uh, had a small group. Not all of us hang out in the group, but it's three of us. Me, my friend Pat, and my um, other friend Jake. And Eric and Carlos, they go do other things. Well, because Carlos has smoke. And Eric, he has stuff going on. So anyway, <laughs> each two-page spread includes three reassuring promises from Scripture. And it's beautiful design for you to color in or enjoy as it is. So it starts out like this. You can always gift it. Oh, look at these beautiful roses. And then it has the three scriptures just like they told you. And then here's another three and a beautiful picture. Now, if you see the truth of it, it isn't a white page, which, you know, most time people don't want to do a white page because um, they want to think that that's cheap. But it is a um, kind of beigey page with the gold in the back. And the colors are dark. So, I, I look at it and I wonder and I'm like, okay, will it um, let the true color that you want on there to reflect through? So, it can be something that you might want to just look at, but I am going to color. My plan, my grand intention is to color. Now, I'm going to show you this real quick just because I had it on hand and it needs to be seen. They have these little cars and I like little tins and I like little tins of cars if my dad was alive I probably would give this to him though it was marked down to five dollars I forget the original price I don't know if it was nine ninety nine or what but it has the cookies inside chocolate chip cookies and I'm gonna tell you I don't really keep food in my basement I'm in, living in the country 
And so, you know, a rat, is, they always had a story, the country rat and the city rat. So everybody got one. But, <laughs> but I don't want the family to come out. So the good thing about these tins is that occasionally I'll be down there and I want something to eat. <laughs> and I can open up these tins and I can get a cookie. And then when I finish, wrap it up and put it back in it. And I, I'm laughing about it, but it is true. There have been some times, because like, I might would give this to my little nephew, who's, well, not nephew, he's my great nephew, because he's my niece's son. But he wouldn't really appreciate it. He would play with it, but he wouldn't really appreciate it. My brother probably ended up taking it from him. But <laughs> it's not something that's antique. It's just a model of... So it would be all right. But I want to show you something, too, that I forgot to show you in the other video and some other videos that I did get. Now, I'm taking it off the stand, so you have to excuse what's happening. These are some, um, those bowls I had yesterday, the paper that they were wrapped in. So, yeah, I'm that person. I folded them down because I am going to put them inside of a, um, I have a container downstairs. So if I have to wrap up something, which my niece, she's going to have to wrap up some dishes. So I'm going to see if she needs some, and I'm going to take them to her house so we can wrap our dishes for a trip. All right, but I didn't show you all is that I got this from Hobby Lobby, too, when I went over the one that I got um, Valentine's Day leftovers. It got heart leftovers. Um, this is a Disney mat. You know, it was $21.99, the outdoor mat, and I got it for $2.19 because it was 90% off. And like I said, they did have some things that were left over. Then I forgot because I had put these in the car, in the trunk, and I kept forgetting to bring these up. But these were from Christmas. I probably got them from that same store. But I may have gotten them from the garden somewhere. Usually, my Lakeshore store and my Gardendale store, they're the ones that have a lot of leftover stuff. And that's because, well, with Gardendale, you don't know Birmingham, but it's kind of further out. So it's a nice neighborhood, nice people. But they have other neighborhoods up there. But after you pass by them, there's not another neighborhood unless they come to Birmingham when you go further out there's not another store for 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 over 30 minutes so this one was 29.99 and I got it for 2.99 and I could almost use this anytime during the I guess winter months but maybe the summer then I got this whole whole home for Christmas one it was about the same let's see 29.99 and I got it for I think they may have marked them did they mark them down to $5? Or was it 90%? It was something like that. But anyway, I didn't pay $29.99 for it. But guess what? You know it's going to last and it's going to be good for me all the way through next year. Now, my baby daughter, she's going to be happy that I finally did this video so I can get this out of the middle of the floor because I had it coming from the living room into the kitchen because I wanted to remember. She was like, it's too rough and it is. You know how they are. They're for brushing off your shoes so that you can enter to a home without putting a lot of dust. Yeah, that's my mug press right there. Still waiting to be used, y'all. I got it from HSN when they had the special and I still haven't used it. So I got to get to it, but I got to go back to work now. Talk to you later.